Hi, I'm Darshan Jayadilaka. Uh, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to register VAMs using uh, VAM CMD command. Okay. Uh, first of all, we should identify what is the requirement of using that command. Okay. Uh, as an example, in this environment, here I have, I'm using the VAM HOA. Here I have one cluster and two nodes. Okay. One, the, the HA is enabled but anyway the one node goes down and it didn't work properly and the one vm is uh, the tiny linux 01 is disconnected okay now immediately i want to power on the vm but the problem is okay the, from the gi we can do that but the problem is in a large environment we should find where is it which means the VX, vmx file then we can register the vm if you know where is the exact location we can register the vm using vmx just right click and register but here actually not here in large environment it's very difficult to find the vmx file okay then what we can do is okay uh, we can ssh to the, the any of the working host in the cluster uh, now i am ssh to the esx dash zero two a okay what I can do is I can find the VMX file using find command. Find print uh, then I have to grab for the tiny Linux 01. Okay, so many files are there, but I want to find out only the VMX file. Okay, VMX. Okay, this is the file first time. Okay, now I am going to use the VIMCMD command. Okay. Uh, if I don't know the command properly, what I can do is just type vimcmd, press enter. The to register the vm, the command is solo. Okay. Okay, solo is there. Then register vm. Then we have to copy and paste vmx path. Okay, it's done. Registered. Okay. Now what we can do is okay, just refresh the web client. Now we can power on the VM. Yeah, now it's working. That's the way where we can use the VIM CMD command to register VM using VMX file. Thank you very much.